What is happening guys back at you with another video and in this video I'm going to be showing off some birthday gifts I got some new autograph Funko Pops plus a couple other random pops that I want to show you so let's go ahead and get to it All right, so like I said, I'm gonna be showing some birthday gifts here. I got a couple of autograph pops too recently, and also too just a couple of random other extra pops that I have to show y'all in this video. So let's go ahead and get on to the actual birthday gifts that I got. So uh, there was a person that actually sent me some birthday gifts in the uh, mail. I want to definitely want to thank her for sending those out to me for my birthday. So it was Alexander Perez that sent me some birthday gifts. Uh, so I definitely want to show y'all what she sent out to me So the first main thing that we got right here. This is definitely a pop I've been wanting to get and I missed out on it first time around I remember they did have like a, a small restock of them And I guess she ended up picking it up for me and she gave it to me for my birthday So what we have is the hot topic exclusive summer stitch this is the actual scented one. I believe it's like strawberry scented or something like that with the snow cone the way it is. So we got the summer stitch here, Hot Topic exclusive pop. So this is definitely one I wanted to get. For those of you that know, Stitch is one of my favorite Disney characters. So I definitely like to get some of the Stitch pops that I like and you know the ones that are out there. So I'm so glad that she sent this my way for my birthday. She also sent out a little uh, goodie bag here that I got. A couple of little uh, cool looking things in here. So what we first we got is a fig pin. So we're adding our fig pins to the collection now. This is the Hot Topic exclusive. Um, I'm not sure what they're calling it. It's like the Hot Topic exclusive stitch, but I'm not sure exactly what they're calling this stitch exactly. But this is pretty cool. I like it the way it is. She said like it's pretty much like resembles me. You know, like the sunglasses and the way he looks and all that. I see he has like a t-shirt on. It has a scrump on there. That's pretty cool, like I guess. Uh, I don't collect too many fig pins. Like, um, I try not to get into them too much, but like, I do like a few of them that are out there. This one was definitely one that's pretty cool that I saw out there. And she actually got it for me for my birthday. So that's pretty cool of her to do that. Hot Topic exclusive out there. Uh, Hot Topic exclusive. You can see right there on the sticker, too. So that's pretty cool. I like it. That's pretty good. Uh, we got another stitch item here. This is a pop keychain. We got the Hot Topic exclusive. Um, this is like the 626 sti uh, stitch. So this is him in his like space outfit with the uh, blasters, guns, you know, he has. So that's pretty cool. Pop keychain. I don't get too many pop keychains. Whenever I do, I usually just hang them out. I hang them about, you know, on the wall or something. So this is pretty cool. I do like it. I definitely want to get the uh, actual pop form of this one eventually. So that was definitely pretty cool of her to send that one out to me. So definitely like that one. And then she sent out this other one, which is another Disney character that I do like. And this is going to be the Baymax. This is the Box Lunch exclusive. Might be Box Lunch exclusive, but this is the Diamond Edition pop keychain of Baymax which is pretty cool so I, I do like Baymax one of my favorite Disney characters also I'll say uh, so definitely pretty cool that she sent that one out my way and then she sent some other goodies too like Dragon Ball Z goodies and stuff so she sent me the Dragon Ball Z inflatable ball that was in one of the Dragon Ball Z boxes like I already have this one and then she also sent me the Goku keychain too so I like I do have these things already so um, but it's nice to have you know kind of extra ones just in case you know so that's pretty cool of her uh, so she also did send a card so I'm gonna read that card for y'all real quick uh, so okay look we have a sticker here so we got a sti uh, stitch sticker right here it says stupid head on there so that's pretty cool and then we got a card here oh look it's a Batman card we got a Batman card look at that a Batman card it says awesome brave and strong <laughs> she put an arrow let me see y'all see that she put a little arrow right there to batman it says edward cullen in reference to uh robert pattinson uh being the new batman so pretty cool all right so she did write some stuff on the inside of it we'll go ahead and read that out there it says dk thanks for being an amazing friend you're the bestest sorry they didn't have any twilight cards but this is close enough hot 
Hashtag Team Edward Batman. Hope you enjoy your gifts. No spoilers, but I think it's a pretty cool gift. Stay awesome. She put like a little smiley face with the sunglasses. Uh, she put, let me see what else she says. She says, hey girl, hey. Hope you have an amazing birthday. Try not to party too hard. Big Papa, AKA Alexandra. So there's a little nickname that uh, she has. Uh, it's Big Papa. That's what she, there's a little nickname for her. Uh, and then also too, it says, you're the coolest birthday boy this side of Gotham City. Happy birthday. So that's pretty nice of her to send a card to and to write some of the stuff on there. Um, so definitely we'll be having this somewhere. So that's pretty cool. That was nice of her to send a card also. I definitely <laughs> like it in this, the way she has this like all funny too and stuff. So that's pretty cool. Uh, this other item she sent out a little bit before my birthday. Like it wasn't it wasn't for my birthday, but she was helping me out and getting this pop. And I asked her, "Can you help me get this pop?" And she was like, "Yeah, sure." And I'm so thankful for her helping me out and getting this pop because I definitely wanted it. Uh, it's an NYCC exclusive pop. So this is the. New York Comic Con exclusive Nightwing. I definitely wanted to get another Nightwing pop into the collection, uh, preferably one with his, um, you know, his more, uh, more uh, the suit that he usually wears that people usually see him wearing. You know, the blue and the black kind of suit, and he has his um, sticks right there too with him, which is pretty cool and a pretty cool pose. I definitely wanted to get one with the suit. It was blue and black. You know, I do have another Nightwing pop. It's actually the disco suit that he wears uh, that he used to wear. That's the only other Nightwing pop I have, but I definitely saw whenever they announced this one. You're near Comic Con. I definitely wanted to try and get it, so I asked her for some help in trying to get it. She was able to pick one up for me and send it my way, so I got to th be thankful for that. She, uh, her helping me out on that one, so I'll thank her. All right, his next gift was a birthday gift, also not from her, but like it was another uh, separate birthday gift that I was end up getting. So this one um, on believe a couple days before thanksgiving or like the day before thanksgiving zobi productions had a sale on autograph pops they had a couple autograph pops that they had available they had a sale on them there's one i definitely wanted is the one i've been wanting to get for a good year and a half now that we want to try to get an autograph pop of this person and i just keep missing out on it and not able to get it but they had a sale a uh, pretty good sale i gotta say and uh was definitely hard to pass up on so I decided to pick it up, you know, as a birthday gift to myself. Um, so what I ended up picking up is an autograph Becky Lynch pop. Now this is actually JSA certified um, to be authentic. So this is an actual autograph from her on this pop, which is so cool. So they had it on sale. Uh, they had it available on sale that one day and definitely jumped at the opportunity of picking it up since it was on sale. But finally got a autograph. Becky Lynch pop into the collection. Been waiting for like a good year and a half now to uh, get one into the collection. So I'm glad, so glad I finally was able to pick one up for a good price and a uh, great addition to the collection. All right, sticking with uh, autograph pops. This one was uh, part of V Shout for those of you that know Zobi Productions does the V Shout, and I, like I said before in a previous video, like I highly recommend that y'all uh, like check it out and you know check out v shout and definitely highly recommend the service because it's pretty good service i already done it like twice and i do plan on doing it some more times in the future so uh what i did send out was the uh send out my sting pop to go get autographs so i got an autograph sting pop now in the collection this one was sent out to get autographed by sting uh, I definitely jumped at an opportunity for that since Sting is one of my all-time favorite wrestlers. I uh, watched him since I was like a little kid and uh, just the things he's been doing with wrestling and all that. I'll be continuing to watch him and all that. So this was definitely one that I wanted to get into the collection. Jumped at the opportunity to get my pop autograph by Sting. And of course, uh, every V shout comes with the shout out video. So I will show you all that. But yeah, that's pretty cool that they do the v, uh, v shout service, like the autograph service. I highly recommend it for those of y'all that um, want to, like y'all missing out Comic Con and stuff like that. I highly recommend it um, that y'all do it if y'all trying to get some more autograph stuff into y'all collection. So definitely check them out. But like, I'm so glad to have this autograph sting pop into the collection now. Definitely a great addition. 
Uh, so, so it's definitely awesome. <laughs> I like it. It's definitely cool, very cool. All right, so the, there's uh, a couple pops I'm going to show y'all real quick. These pops, um, I haven't really shown a video yet, but they're just some random pops that I had uh, got over, you know, a few months and stuff like that. I just haven't really gotten to showing a video just yet. So uh, I remember getting this one from I believe Boom Loot. They had a restock of these ones, uh, and at the time that they had the restock, this one was like kind of not very expensive, but it was like um, like twenty something dollar range or something like that PPG value. But it was like kind of harder to find for like a good price, you know, around there. But Boom Loot, they had like a small restock of these pops, and they were selling them for retail. So I definitely jumped at the opportunity to pick one up. Um, so the one I ended up getting is the Post Malone Pop. For those of you that know, uh, or for those of you that don't, might not know, that I do like Post Malone. I like his songs. So I definitely wanted to try to get, pick up a Post Malone Pop and get one into the collection. So this one is, uh more from his old one of his older albums that he did um so definitely pretty cool looking pop i gotta say kind of a cool looking design you see the details that he, they have on there with the way his tattoos are like his face tattoos and his other tattoos that he has and of course he has like a signature red solo cup there so pretty cool design on this pop i definitely wanted to get one into the collection since um i do like his songs and all that so uh definitely pretty cool pop to add to the collection this other one I'm going to show y'all is uh, one that was um, one I want. I definitely did want to pick up. I do like the movies. I like this uh, character. Uh, I definitely wanted to pick up. I just never got around to picking it up. Like it, it was there. It kept being there. It was, I just like I kept seeing it and seeing it, and like I just never got around to picking it up. But finally, I did one day pick it up. And um, the pop that I ended up picking up is the GameStop exclusive Predator. So this is the one where he's like about to be cloaked. Y'all can see like some of the blue specks going on. That's like he's means he's about to like go invisible or like cloak himself, you know, um, from the other people in there. So this is basically the one from the first movie, I believe. Um, it looks like it's the first movie logo predator on there. So you can see how he has. It's a pretty cool one. I got to say this is probably one of the best looking uh, predator pops that they have out there. I like the way he's like in his uh, like a pretty cool stance, and then he has like um, the uh, razor, the razor claw things sticking out right there too on one arm, and uh, just the overall like kind of blue and white specs going on, making it look like he's about to cloak himself from the people. So I gotta say it's a pretty cool looking pop. I do, do definitely like it. I did did want to get a predator pop into the collection eventually, and they finally had this one. And I kept seeing it and stuff like that and then I finally got around to picking it up one day So definitely glad to add this to the collection now yeah. Alright guys, so that's all I'm going to show y'all in this video Let me know down in the comments below what y'all think of this kind of pop haul or whatever kind of haul it is Birthday gifts and all guy pops and other pop uh, other random pops I showed y'all in this video Let me know down in the comments below which one was your favorite to look at uh, so it's pretty good good additions to the collection. I gotta say definitely enjoy getting some new um, Additions to the collection and all that so let me know down in the comments which I think of this and um, Yeah, so that's gonna do it for this video. Hope y'all all enjoyed remember if you want to be a part of team legendary All you gotta do is subscribe and turn notifications on so you know I post another video Hope y'all all have an awesome day and remember be legendary